Welcome to Kettle Labs How To Series. Today we'll demonstrate how to build and deploy machine learning models with Microsoft Fabric. Sign into Fabric and let's get started. First, we begin by loading the data into a PySpark data frame. We store the data set in a variable to prepare it for further processing using PySpark. Next, we convert this PySpark data frame into a Pandas data frame. After that, we leverage Fabric's data wrangle feature, which simplifies feature engineering through its intuitive interface. This allows us to apply complex transformations effortlessly. We then create a new column risk using the formula displayed on the screen and execute the code in the notebook. To gain better insights into our data, we calculate descriptive statistics using the describe function. This provides a quick overview of key metrics such as the mean, standard deviation, and more. Now, it's time to build our first machine learning model. We import the necessary libraries from sklearn for model creation and evaluation. First, we split the data into training and testing sets using the train test split method. To monitor model performance, we use MLflow to log metrics and parameters. Here, we create our first experiment for a linear regression model, which helps us effectively track its performance. Next, we build a logistic regression model to predict risk. Similar to the linear regression model, we use MLflow to create a new experiment for tracking this model's performance. Once the logistic regression model is trained, we use it to generate predictions. These predictions are stored in a new column prediction within the original data frame. This ensures that the results are easily accessible for further analysis. Finally, the updated data frame, now including the prediction column, is saved to the Lakehouse table. You can view the data in the Lakehouse table folder. This approach ensures that both the data and predictions are preserved for future use. Stay tuned for more tutorials on Fabric. Thanks for watching.